fighting for in that, but I get through the whole Yeah, but I remember, yeah. well, go ahead, Paula, because I'm going to tell oh, this story okay. after. Well, Please. It, uh, now, you know, we, our vice presidential candidate on the Republican side is Sarah Palin, who is a hockey mom. Yeah. We all know this, right? Yes. Mm. Now, I, for years and years, I've been telling stories about being a hockey mom. If you had just kept the go damn ahead. book. Did you keep the book? What book? I remember you hockey wrote mom. the book. I did write the book. No, I didn't keep That's it. That's the first thing I thought when Sarah oh, Palin and the hockey mom, hockey the very first book. Toothless Quebec was one of the characters. I remember that Toothless Quebec. I remember after but you got it done, you were going to try and get it published. because it really And I did. Like it was awesome. I did try to get it published. Yes. And I got a whole wall full of rejection slips. No kidding. Oh, yeah. I bet oh, you wouldn't funny. now. Wood, Woodman Press, Woodman Press or something. Anyway, I tell the story now about having three boys on three separate hockey teams. Ugh. And how it, it, there's nothing in the world like being at a hockey practice at five in the morning in January. Well, I remember. I remember you're talking about the hot uh, chocolate in the out of the machine. I remember you're talking about doing the <laughs> carpooling with all three with kids, the, smelling all the hockey. And then, right, and then picking up the neighbors' kids who also smelled like. And then bags. somebody inevitably forgot one skate. Right. And then <laughs> skate. Oh. Well, I played goal twice because Kevin couldn't get to the 